Earth was once dominated by dinosaurs during the late Cretaceous period. However, they were unaware of a massive asteroid that was racing towards the planet and had the destructive force of a billion suns. When it entered the atmosphere, it caused a brilliant light to be seen far and wide. This event led to 75% of all creatures on Earth going extinct. Yet, Earth itself remained. This prompts the question of whether the planet could be immune to an asteroid and what it would take for it to be completely destroyed. It appears that an asteroid would have to be much larger than the one that caused the dinosaur's extinction in order to fully annihilate the planet. The giant impact hypothesis suggests that a Mars-sized planet, Thea, collided with Earth 4.5 billion years ago, forming the Moon. Scientists disagree on the circumstances of the impact, but it could have wiped out any life that may have been on Earth at the time. According to NASA, any space rock that is within 4.6 million miles and has a diameter of 460 feet or more can destroy a city if it collides with Earth. A bigger rock measuring 0.6 miles or more could trigger the end of civilization. Recently, NASA has discovered three particularly large asteroids that may fly past Earth, one of which is 2015 BY310 which has a diameter of 490 feet. According to NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies, the first asteroid, that is 2015 BY310 will be spotted on March 7. This huge asteroid is expected to be approximately 490 feet in diameter and will fly past Earth on March 7 at a speed of 27,720 km per hour at a distance of 4 million kilometers. Astronomers will use this opportunity to gather more information about this asteroid. They'll be studying its shape, size, rotation, and composition. This information will help us better understand the origins and evolution of these celestial bodies. The second of the three asteroids, 2018 UQ1, is also making its close approach to Earth this month. This asteroid is estimated to be about 459 feet in diameter, making it a significant object in the solar system. It will fly past Earth on March 17 at a speed of 42,120 km per hour at a distance of 4.1 million kilometers. The third asteroid to approach Earth this month is 2017 SE-12. This asteroid is estimated to be 50 feet in diameter and is expected to come relatively very close to our planet. This year, the asteroid 2017 SE-12 will fly past Earth on March 29 at, at a distance of 2.7 million kilometers at a speed of 8.6 kilometers per second. Scientists keep track of asteroids as even the slightest change in trajectory can cause them to collide with Earth which would release an enormous amount of energy equivalent to millions of nuclear bombs and cause destruction across the planet. Earthquakes, tsunamis, and volcanic eruptions would follow, and after the dust settled, the atmosphere would become choked with ash and dust, blocking out the sun and causing a global winter. NASA and the ESA have been monitoring thousands of asteroids in order to prevent any impacts from potentially hazardous space rocks. Fortunately, no such impacts are expected for the next 100 years. However, in order to prepare for the future, NASA will be testing a plan to deal with any dangerous asteroid threats. If you really like our video feel free to support us with a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe our channel Spacebytes and look forward to the videos that will be waiting for you in the future.